Welcome to your daily devotional reading from the book My Life Today. Month of November, A Victorious Life. November 26th, With Love. Charity suffereth long and is kind, charity envieth not, charity vaunteth not itself, is not puffed up. 1 Corinthians 13 verse 4 Those who open their hearts and homes to invite Jesus to abide with them should keep the moral atmosphere unclouded by strife, bitterness, wrath, malice, or even an unkind word. Jesus will not abide in a home where our contention, envy, and bitterness. Paul had a healthful religious experience. The love of Christ was his grand theme and the constraining power that governed him. When in most discouraging circumstances, which would have had a depressing influence upon halfway Christians, he is firm of heart, full of courage and hope and cheer, exclaiming, Rejoice in the Lord always, and again I say, rejoice. The same hope and cheerfulness is seen when he is upon the deck of the ship, the tempest beating about him, the ship going to pieces. He gives orders to the commander of the ship and preserves the lives of all on board. Although a prisoner, he is really the master of the ship, the freest and happiest man on board. When wrecked and driven to a barbarous island, he is the most self-possessed, the most helpful in saving his fellow men from a watery grave. His hands brought the wood to kindle the fire for the benefit of the chilled, shipwrecked passengers. When they saw the deadly viper fastened upon his hand, They were filled with terror, but Paul calmly shook it into the fire, knowing it could not harm him, for he implicitly trusted in God. When before kings and dignitaries of the earth, who held his life in their hands, he quailed not, for he had given his life to God. Grace, like an angel of mercy, makes his voice heard sweet and clear, repeating the story of the cross, the matchless love of Jesus. Love's agencies have wonderful power, for they are divine. A Victorious Life, November 26th